bruh. Alright, so that's me with bed hair, but let me show y'all how to fix it, and it's gonna turn out something like this. Yeah, yeah, What's happening, O Double A Squad? It's your boy, Always Ron, back here with a another one. You know what I'm saying? Sorry if the quality, if the camera is like a little wobbly. It's because I, I'm not actually using my setup. It's just a quick video. You know what I'm saying? I came up with this idea yesterday. Basically, I'm about to teach y'all how to fix like bad hair, freeform dreads. I know I look tired and stuff because like I literally just got I'm fresh out of bed y'all like Ron is fresh out of bed I literally just got up and I thought of this idea I'm like I want to teach these people how I fix my bed hair like freeform my freeform dress you know what I'm saying like I literally just woke up so if I look a little tired and sound tired that's because that's why you know what I'm saying I got my do rag on. My head look a little crooked. It's because the way I sleep, the way I put my hair before I put the do rag on, it like makes my hair like that. If it make any sense, if that make any sense. But uh, I'm about to make this video quick and easy. I'm about to show y'all how I fix my bed hair in the morning. What I do like every day to like fix it so it can look. You know what I'm saying? Picture perfect. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I'm not gonna talk too much. Just, I'm about to show y'all. So, let's get to it. Alright, so here we go. We in the bathroom now, you know what I'm saying? Basically, and the light in here, like, you trash. But anyway, you wanna sleep with a, a cap. I wanna, I forgot to mention, you wanna sleep with a cap or a do rag. Something that can, like, go over your head. Because, like, you don't want breakage while you sleep. Like, it's important that you get a do rag or a cap. You can go buy one at a, like a hair store. It don't cost that much. It really don't. You need one of these so you don't have so much breakage when you wake up. You know, when you go to sleep and you're rolling around, you don't want to have that breakage. Plus, <clears throat> it's better because when you don't sleep with a do rag and you wake up, your hair. If you don't sleep with none of your hair, like your hair is like so wild. I hate having my hair like that. It be like everywhere. It's like harder to fix and stuff. But uh, I'm about to take this do rag off. I'm about to show y'all what my hair look like. And uh, my hair is about to look like bad because this bad hair. Like that's what y'all clicked on the video for. So it's about to look bad. I'm like shit out. That's up. But uh, this is what my hair look like. This is what I look wild. Look at this. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah this is bad hair. Freeform dread bad hair. This is what my hair look like about every morning. Terrible. Look how flat it looks, bro. This is how I look every morning, bro. But I'm about to show y'all how to fix this. So, basically, what you want to do. So there's two things, right? So when you get up in the morning, you want to get a little bit of water. All right, so this part, I forgot to turn the water off. So I'm just going to talk over it. But anyways, basically what I was doing was you just get a little bit of water in your hand like this. I can't really show y'all because it kept falling out. But you just want to put it in your hand and just rub it in circular motions. Like, you know, one of those hair sponge a little twisty sponge you just want to rub in circles like i'm doing up there you know what i'm saying just do what i'm doing rub in circular motion with the water if you need to use a little bit more water like i did go ahead but you don't want to use like 
tons of water like how your hair is soaked because that's bad and you don't want bad you want good so use a little bit like I did don't use too much and then just sponge your hair like this and once you're done with that go ahead and get your hair a little shake you know what I'm saying left and right up and down get your hair shake a good shake Use your finger combs to like, you know, pull it down a little bit and that's it. That's how, that's how I fix my hair every morning, my fault for the water. But basically, you just want to get a little bit of water, sponge it in your hair, circular motions, and then that'll be it. And, uh, now, every day I don't like use water all the time. You don't want to use water because you need a moisturizer too. So, every other day, you get moisturizer. I'm using this moisturizer. I'm telling y'all, this moisturizer right here, y'all seen in my other hair videos. This is a very good moisturizer. I got it from like, I don't even remember where I got it from. I'm sorry. I said it in my pre in another video. I'm sorry, I forgot. Like, I had this for so long. This stuff smell good and it feel good on your scalp. Like, this stuff is good. I've been using this for a long time. This stuff feel good and smell good and it works. Like if y'all haven't, I will go pick this up. This is my moisturizer I use. But anyways, I need to get some more because it's, it's empty for real. But uh, every other day you just want to get some moisturizer. When you don't use water, you don't want to use water every other. That's like the day you don't moisturize your hair. So every other day, I don't got a lot in here. You just want to after you take your do rag off or whatever, just get your moisturizer. This is all I really need some more, but get your moisturizer. So you got your bad hair, just rub it in like this. Just rub it in. Look at my hands, like try to massage the scalp too. Like try to massage the hair. And rub it in. Get all your moisturizer in there. And then just like rub it in there, you know what I'm saying? For y'all that's like your hair is like shorter than mine. Just like go like this. To wake it up when you're using the water. This will help your forms a lot better. And uh, yeah, so you want you want to moisturize every other day. In the days that you don't moisturize, you just use water and do what I showed you. It's important to moisturize too because if you don't moisturize your freeform dreads, they're not gonna grow fast. Like it's very important. So make sure you're moisturizing your hair. And uh, so that's the end of the video, you know what I'm saying, bro? That's all y'all need to do. Make sure y'all like that's what it, literally what I do every day to like wake my freeforms up. And uh, that's really it, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully this video is not too long because it really don't take that long. It's fast and easy. That's it, you know what I'm saying? So hopefully y'all like the video. If y'all want to check out any of my other hair videos, I got a playlist. I'll put, I'll try to put it in the description. I'm gonna try to remember. I'll put it in the description of my hair tutorials my hair playlist so y'all can check that out uh i got to read how to retwist free forms how to maintain help them grow i got like all of those so i mean it's, it's four videos but it's they still help you know what i'm saying so i'll drop i'll leave that in the description hopefully y'all enjoyed the video drop a like man if this really helped y'all and uh that's the end of the video, you know what I'm saying? Now I'm about to go brush my teeth, wash my face, and shower. Now that I got this video out the way. But yeah, that's the end of this video. It's your boy, Always Ron, Sonny, out. Bop.